I hope we don't have a recording. Hey guys, how are you? It doesn't matter. Let the music play. That's even a song lyric too. It's off. Okay, it is hotter than... Okay. How are you guys? I have a Dollar Tree haul to show you. Um, today is uh, Sunday. Hope you guys are having a great weekend. 17th. It has taken me weeks, maybe days, they feel like weeks, to come out here. Every morning I want to come out here because I want to come in the Dollar Tree and get some stuff. I'm, I ain't going to give you no hour excuse or all that bull crap because people want to come at me, bring it on. Um, and people don't, so I'm blessed. But anyway, I, I just, I'm so tired of hearing that, you know, people need excuses why they want to go out and buy some damn eggs or some bread or, you know, something. So anyway, welcome to realism. But I wanted to show you guys this shirt, Eeyore with his mask on, quarantined 2020. My, uh, one of my friends, oh, I didn't need to move a brawl. Uh, one of my friends from uh, one of my churches, what, two churches? No, three churches ago. Um, well, the first church that I signed, uh, that I went to after I had been MIA from church for a very long time, um, since I was like, I don't know how old, like it really matters. But she had asked me one day on Facebook what my address was. And I thought, well, that's weird. Maybe she's going to send me a prayer card or write me a letter, you know, or something. And then she had messaged me the day before the shirt came or the night before the shirt came and was like, did you get anything? And I'm like, uh, no. And then she's like, well, you're supposed to got it today. Then I felt like she was jumping all over me. I'm like, hold the phone, ma'am. You know, I'm like, but anyway, so um, now my head's going to sweat. That's what I hate about summer. My head sweats. I've got to wash my hair like double more than when I wash it. Ugh. But anyway, so this came the next day that she had messaged me. And I was like, well, I didn't know. I didn't order this because it, you know, came from the, the seller. Didn't have her, you know, address. But isn't that cute? She said every time she sees Eeyore. She thinks of me because I love Eeyore. I am 44. Yes, you all know. You all know about me. You know, I will buy Eeyores, whether they are plush, ceramic, porcelain, crystal, as long as they ain't expensive. Okay, no, I don't. It's your fault that you bought me that one that was crystal. Okay, let's get into the Dollar Tree hey, haul. Let me, let me shut up. Well, it is, but I didn't ask for it. Thank you very much. That was your, came from my heart. That was your doing. Okay, so, okay, heart. zip it. I've already had enough of you, Warden Eric. <laughs> Y'all can give me the finger for that. I don't care. He has got on my nerves. Everything I try to pick up, it was like, you already have one of them. And I'm like, I'm not getting it for me. I'm getting it for my friend. Because I don't know if I got her one. I might have. I don't remember. And he's like, well, you got one downstairs. And I'm like, well, that's mine. He's like, well, why do you need two? I'm like, I was looking for baseball bats, y'all. I was looking for baseball bats. Anyway, let me hurry up. So I got this unicorn. CJ, I got you one. I might as well tell you because I don't want you to buy it. Hopefully you don't already have it. If you don't like it, then let me know. But it's a unicorn, whatever it's supposed to be, a unicorn for all the holidays. So there you go. Well, most of them. So I got her one and me one. Oh, damn it. I should have got my other friend one, but somebody will probably send her one. That's what I don't like. I don't like wasting money. Um, you know, when people already have something like I, I did that, I wasted a dollar and they come to find out I watched my friend's video and she got the item that I got her trying to get her a surprise package, you know, since she had sent me, you know, things and it's a headache. I'm just, you know, anyway, um, let's see. Fiona had hauled these. These are the driver's choice. Um, I can't think of her channel. I don't even know if I'm pronouncing her name right. Um, you know, my, with my tooth gone, it, I, some of my words come out weird. Um, you know, there's a lot of air. Um, thrifted, is it, is your channel name thrifted? I think it's thrifted divas. Why was I going to ask Eric? He doesn't watch my people. Okay. Yeah. So she had hauled these for the hubby and driver's choice. I was actually thinking about taking this one. Sorry, y'all. I'm not even showing you guys, but they are two sponges. I keep wanting to say three, but this one has a, where you hold it on here. Yeah, you can hold it there and then, but they're ideal for wax application. But this one I thought, well, maybe I just wash the car with it. That'd be all day. But anyway, I got one for me and one for Father's Day. So, you know, whatever. Are you rushing me? 
No. Now, the thing that really picked, ticked me off is that my phone and I last night were arguing. And I had done another, well, I had done the video that you guys have, the last video that I did on my memory decks. And I probably have to do another one. Actually, I'm not going to, I'm not going to do it. Because I actually went back with more yarn, or more trim, I should say, and jazzed it up even more. I can't talk that fast, Eric. I'm fat. See that. Okay, so fat. I'm not sure if there's a nautical rope that is a different color or if this is the nautical rope, but if it is, I think I already have this. But I thought it was a different color and I had a picture of it, but I don't know if it's this color. You know what? I think it's not this color. I think it's more like a, a lighter tannish, prettier maybe color. I'm not, not like, not like this color's ugly. Anyway, decorative nautical rope, 0 0.4 inches times 7 times. 7.9 feet. Now he's got me in a hot ass hurry. I got um, this container. I don't know if I already have it, but I got this because I have those, um, you know, the typewriter that they sold at Michael's. I have the typewriter. It's still in the box um, along with my Cricut Air. I wish I could have returned that thing because I don't know how to use a stupid thing. Um, but anyway, so... I have those um, little, they're about like this big, and some of you guys might get them in like pocket letters and stuff. I, I've now lost them. But anyway, I thought they could fit in here, so that's why I got this for, because um, Linda's Thrifty Life had hauled this, and she had put like, I don't know if they were tags or what they were, and it, it gave me the idea of those little um, like label-ish things that I have. I'm like, oh, they could all fit in here, all nice and together and happy. So that's the reason for that. And then everybody was hauling these. Well, not everybody. I've seen maybe one person or I don't know. But I just saw this one laying around and I just thought it was too cute and girly. Not that I even use purses, but I don't know what I'm going to do with this. I could put like a, I could put like a scene in here. Like maybe have it, no, I guess it wouldn't work like that, but you know, put like a little scene and then when you open up, you get surprised. Well, I would, but anyway, or I could just hang it in my room. Yeah, I don't know. Put something in it. Who knows? But I got it because when somebody hauled one, I'm like, oh, that is so cute. I've never seen this. Okay. And then the last bag, y'all, I about flipped out that they didn't have this. Where is it? I, I went through two of these and I was literally going to cry that they did not have these stinking dowels and then I saw them and I ran over to the shelf I was going to buy like two or three in case I mess up but you get um 10 pieces in here they are 0 0.25 inches times 12 inches so this is what I need because the smaller dowels are too small for my box because like I told you well my box is eight and a half so I don't know how how small the small ones you know the small ones are in length Okay, and then CJ had told me that I got her one of these, but just in case if I didn't or I lost it, I got another one. And then I, oh, uh, this is funny. I couldn't find, can you hold that for a minute, Warden? I couldn't find, <laughs> I can, I can, I can, I can tell myself now, Eric knows. But, um, so I could not find my double-sided tape. I have a, um, that one of those, uh, caboodles, you know, for like makeup and I put my scrapbooking, you know, some of my like my foam stuff, my double-sided tapes in there. Um, some of my tools are in there. Well, I could not find the stinking caboodle because after we put my, my day bed in, I don't know where the heck hardly anything is in there. Okay. Well, so I really needed my double-sided tape, right? And so I found, um, the bag that I had CJ stuff in and I had gotten her two of these. So I took one of hers <laughs> to use it so I had to replace the one that I got for her so here it is okay so yeah I have to laugh at myself because I, I did not believe I was telling myself okay this was like super cute it's called the Crayola super coloring activity book oh it includes stickers really where in the center <gasps> oh my gosh I'm so look at this y'all this was in the front of the, the very front of the store you know where they put the impulse stuff but I mean look at this so I got this for me. I know. But they're just what? 44 and a half. 34 and a half. I, I wish. Said, I said 44 and a half. Uh, well, I, I'm going to show you the same page. I don't know. I don't know how I can flip through this. That you guys could really see. 
But isn't that cute? I really wanted to give it to my friend's nephew, I think it is. But, I, but because of my leg, I didn't go back to get one. And then I found these. These were single all by themselves. These are Olaf and, and Spin. So, you know, I love Olaf as well. So I got those. And then Linda from Linda's Thrifty Life had hauled this meow sign. But her, her letters, I think, were in like a grayish blue or blue or something. But I found the yellow ones and I like the yellow. How the hell do you get yellow out of that? Oh my gosh, y'all. White. <laughs> so I went ahead and got this one. And then I found the wolf one and I just grabbed, I don't know if they came in another color besides the brown, but I got that one. And then I, this was on my list, the Freeman Brightened Cucumber Peel Off Face Mask. So I got that. And it doesn't have a, um, oh, mm, dang, I should have got, it almost smells like cucumber and pickles. <laughs> I guess who's hungry? This fat chick. Okay, and this is 1.5 fluid ounces, so I got two of them. I have a big face. I should have got four. And then I was excited to see... Oh, wait a minute. Let me show you. Um, everybody and their mothers hauling this. The Salt Range Himalayan Pink Salt Lip Balm, Cherry and Shea Butter. And I passed on it. And then after I passed on it, and I'll open it up and try it. Um, after I passed on it, I was so mad because they didn't come back. Well, they came back, you know, now. Okay, so that's what the packaging looks like. Very plain and simple, and this is like clear as can be. It smells okay. Oh wow, this is nice. It doesn't help when you're hungry and something. Wow, it almost did that cat like leave. Yes. Look how um, long the lid is. I guess it's maybe if you, uh, you know what I thought, and this is 0 0.15 ounces, not, I don't, like, not that it matters. Wow. It is so, I don't know what it, what is all up, because you know what I thought? I thought it was going to be like gritty because it had salt in it, and I'm like, why do we have salt in a lip balm? And so that's why I kept passing on it. I'm like, that is, you know, that was just weird to me, but y'all pick this up. This is amazing. This might be the smoothest um, you know, lip stuff that I've ever put on my lips. Okay, and then I found the Hard Candy Feeling Malvi. So I thought that was really, really pretty. A lot of colors. I really need to get into making this look better. Um, I usually only really put on makeup for funerals. I used to put makeup on for funerals and weddings, and now I just go all natural. And you're fine, natural. I know I do that wrong, y'all. It's left to right, not right to left. But, you know, I'm different. <laughs> I'm going to go to jail for beating up my warden. He's laughing, thinking just because I can't get him on the ground doesn't mean that I can't whoop his tail. You can't. Is that, is that a dare? <laughs> no. Please make it a dare. I will jump out this car. <laughs> You'll be on the ground so fast you won't know what happened. I'm missing a sponge. I know I'm uh, say I know I'm hungry, but I did not eat that joker. Okay, y'all, that's all that I got. Where's um I wanted I wanted to read you all the things that what? Oh, and then I got this um thank you, Warden. I got this plant hanger. Well, yeah, well that's what they're calling it a plant hanger. I got this because my my great uncle that we, we passed the graveyard basically where you know a lot of my family is buried and I saw somebody have this with a, a plant a pot a pot hanging from it and I thought well you know what since he doesn't have a um, you know he doesn't have one of those vases because I guess they just bought like the cheapest you know plot thing that they could you know buy so he doesn't, he doesn't have one and, um, you know, like one of the vases that come out of the thing, I forgot what it's called. What is his problem? He's just going everywhere. And Play so, um, seafood place. Yeah, man. Oh, this is not even my list. Where is my list? 
so anyway I got the idea from somebody that they had that they had that and I thought oh I'm gonna try to do that for him and see if it'll stay maybe I won't put real flowers but anyway so I did not find the ceramic strainer I wanted to get one in a color because I seen somebody haul one in a color and then I couldn't find I have all of these canvases written down here I wanted to find for me and my friends my one friend who wouldn't know about it and then I wanted to get the squishy surprises there was no TY's I couldn't find the fruit zipper bags that my friend showed me now she's got me wanting them too well two of them and the nautical rope I think I think there's another color oh crap I forgot to look for the chef Boyardee pasta and butter sauce and I can't find the galvanized you know pot I'm just sharing you know my list y'all because this is the first time and then I almost forgot it at home and then you know how they had and I I, I was so dumb because this store had the galvanized you know with the with the hooker thing on it I didn't pick it up I had the ultimate garden book there's some new pink face wipes the and I forgot to look for the cocoa dips cookies and those magnetic hooks that I saw um what is her name? I got her face. Shoot. I don't know. But I saw her haul them. Or they were in her Instagram photo. But anyway. So, yep. I don't know. I'm debating on the Jack Link Bites because they're spicy. And I don't really do spicy. I mean, not like a lot, a lot of spicy. But anyway. But I was happy to. I mean, it was good to have this list with me. Because I wasn't, I didn't have to focus on like crazy people. It's supposed to be like 70, it's 66 degrees and I'm sweating. And it ain't like it takes any fat off, so what is the point of sweating? Shut up. It's big bone. Yeah, big bone my butthole. I wish I could show y'all how fat Eric, Eric has gotten. <laughs> he was so skinny, y'all. His waist was like this. Okay. Yeah, 32, 32. And now, now it's like, <laughs> I can't even stretch it. I ain't that big. He's a big boy. He, he, his, his belly is bigger than mine. It looks like he's going to have triplets. I keep, I keep patting it, asking him when they're, when he's going to let him out. When my, when my grandfather, you know, was, was, um, you know, got in the, in the chubby, in the chubby world, um, the big boy world too, you know, his uh, nephews and stuff would all come over, you know, and not like he was that fat, but he, you know, there was a belly, you know, it wasn't like a beer belly, but it was just a belly and they would, they would come over and, you know, rub it and he hated it. But I mean, he didn't let them know, but he would, he would be like, they would be like, you know, what are you delivering? You know, yada, yada, yada. And they did lose their weight too. He just smiled and wanted to growl at them and, you know, but anyway, so... But that's it, y'all. I'm going to get off of here. Yeah, and I will good. I will talk to you guys later. I hope you guys have a blessed one. And I guess I'm going to go home and get in my car and um, hope my mask is in the car and take myself to the other one. So I'm going to talk to you guys later. Um, I think I already said have a blessed one. I don't even know what the heck I'm saying. Um, I still got Eric and I's bickering back, uh, back and forth in my head. But anyway... <laughs> keep it real y'all be you don't worry about people if you want to go into the daggone store and and buy a bouquet of flowers do it you know you don't know body no rhyme or reason or what the hell you went in there for it ain't their fault that they're chicken that they don't want to go in the store i mean yeah i'm chicken too but i go in there <laughs> but y'all this mask this this thing got on my nerves it didn't get on my nerves what yesterday the day before whenever we went out and I tried to double it, and then I felt like I couldn't breathe. Um, and, you know, had uh, had it going in my mouth. And then I felt like I had a, you know, like saliva. Like I was going to have this, you know, like all this saliva, you know. <laughs> like this wetness on my mask. People be like, what are you doing? Melting in there? But I just, you know, I just had to keep messing with it. It drove me bananas. All right, y'all. I'm not going to say that I'm leaving again. No, I don't have fleas. I'm just sweating and it makes my head itch. So, that's it. I'll talk to you guys later. Have a blessed Sunday. Hope your weekend is great. Holy hell. I didn't know that was 19 minutes. Dad gone. And, all right. I don't even care. I'm not even going to turn into one of them. All right, y'all. Peace out. Bye.